The Empire of China was a short-lived attempt by statesman and general Yuan Shikai from late 1915 to early 1916 to reinstate monarchy in China, with himself as the Hongzhen Emperor, Hong Xian Huang Di Hongzhen Wangdi. The attempt was ultimately a failure, it set back the Chinese Republican cause by many years and fractured China into a period of conflict between various local warlords. Preparations for formation After Yuan Shikai was installed as the second provisional Great President of the Republic of China, he took various steps to consolidate his power and remove opposition leaders from office. To secure his own power he collaborated with various European powers as well as Japan. Around August 1915, he instructed Yang Du, Yang du et al. to canvass support for a return of a monarchy. On the 11th of December 1915, an assembly unanimously elected him as emperor. Yuan ceremonially declined, but relented, and immediately agreed when the National Assembly petitioned again that day. On 12 December, Yuan, supported by his son Yuan Keting, declared the Empire of China with himself as the Great Emperor of the Chinese Empire. Simplified Chinese, Zhang Hua Di Guo Da Huang Di Traditional Chinese, Zhang Hua Di Guo Da Huang Di Pinyin, Zhang Hua Di Guo Da Wang Di, taking the era name Hongzhen, Simplified Chinese, Hong Xian Traditional Chinese, Hong Xian Pinyin, Hongzhen, Constitutional Abundance. However, Yuan, now known as the Hongzhen Emperor, delayed the accession rights until 1 January 1916. He had Manchurian clothes removed from culture and had Han Chinese clothes revived but had put some changes to it. He wore new Han clothes to attend a dress rehearsal. A dress rehearsal was sabotaged by his Korean concubine. Soon after, the Hongzhen Emperor started handing out titles of peerage to his closest relatives and friends, as well as those whom he thought he could buy with titles. The Aizen Gioro family, then living within the Forbidden City but as foreign monarchs rather than Chinese ones, approved of the Hongzhen Emperor's accession, and even proposed a royal marriage of the Emperor's daughter to Puyi. Backlash The year 1916 was to be Hongzhen Year 1, Hong Xian Yuan Yen rather than Republic Year 5. Min Guo Wu Yen but the Hongzhen Emperor was opposed by not only the revolutionaries, but far more importantly by his subordinate military commanders, who believed that Yuan's assumption of the monarchy would allow him to rule without depending on the support of the military. Province after province rebelled after his inauguration, starting with Yunnan, led by the Emperor's Governor Kai Yi and General Tang Jiao and Yang Shi, led by Governor Li Lijun. The revolters formed the National Protection Army Hu Guo Jun and thus began the National Protection War. This was followed by other provinces declaring independence from the empire. The emperor's Baiyang generals, whose soldiers had not received pay once from the imperial government, did not put up an aggressive campaign against the National Protection Army and the Baiyang Army suffered numerous defeats despite being better trained and equipped than the National Protection Army. Seeing the Hongzhen Emperor's weakness and in popularity, foreign powers withdrew their support but did not choose sides in the war. The Empire of Japan first threatened to invade, then committed to overthrowing the Hongzhen Emperor and recognized both sides of the conflict to be in a state of war and allowed Japanese citizens to help the Republicans. Faced with universal opposition, the Emperor repeatedly delayed the accession rights to appease his foes. Funding for the ceremony was cut on 1 March. Yuan deliberated abandoning the monarchy with Liang Shiyi on 17 March and abandoned it on of March. The Hongzhen year was abolished on 23 March and the Republic calendrical system restored. Yuan reigned a total of 83 days. After Yuan's death on 5 June Vice President Li Yuanhong assumed the presidency, and appointed Baiyang General Duan Kirui as his premier and restored the National Assembly and the Provisional Constitution. However, the central authority of the Beijing government was significantly weakened and the demise of Yuan's empire plunged China into a period of warlordism. Topic. National symbols Although the name of the country in Chinese was changed to the Empire of China and Hongzhen for state matters, the Hongzhen Emperor continued to use Republic of China 
As the English name, the Hongzhen Emperor set up the Ritual Regulations Office, Li Ji Guan which issued the new official anthem for the Republic of China. China heroically stands in the universe. Zhang Hua Shang Li Yu Zhou Jian in June 1915. Its lyrics were written by Yin Chong Yin Chong and music by Wang Lu. Wang Lu. The lyrics were slightly modified in December 1915, with Gong He Wu Zhu five races under one union replaced by Xuan Hua Yi Rang Shan Rang, the ancient system of Chinese emperor relinquishing seats to others in Yao and Shun's era. To be used during the Hongzhen Emperor's reign. Yao was a legendary Chinese ruler. The era of Yao and Shun Yao Tian Shun Ri is a four-character idiom which means times of peace and prosperity. The national flag was changed from the original five-stripe flag to one where the red stripe is a centered cross, however, a flag with the former red stripe as a saltire was the version commonly used. The national emblem remained as the national emblem of the Republic of China 1913-1928, national emblem of twelve symbols of sovereignty. Shi Er Zhang Guo Topic. List of people given peerage by the Hongzhen Emperor Topic. Crown Prince, Huang Tai Yun Tai Yun Tai Topic. Prince of the First Rank Wu Yi Wu Yi Qin Wang Wu Yi Qin Wang Duke Yan Sheng Kong Lingyi Yan Sheng Gong Kong Ling Yi Li Yuan Hung Li Yuan Hung Topic Dukes of the First Rank Yi Deng Gong Yi Deng Gong Duan Zigi Duan Ji Gui Feng Guo Zhang Feng Guo Zhang Zhang Gui Ti Zhang Gui Ti Lu Guang Shang Lu Guan Shang Long Ji Guang Long Ji Guang Ni Sishang Ni Si Chang Zhang Shuan Zhang Shuan Topic Marquises of the First Rank Yi Deng Hu Yi Deng Hu Chen Yi Shane Yi Li Chun Li Chun Lu Rongjing Lu Rong Ting Tang Ji Yao Tang Ji Yao Tang Shang Ming Tang Shang Ming Wang Zanyuan Wang Zanyuan Yan Qishan Yan Shishan Zhao Ti Zhao Ti Zhu Rui Zhu Rui Topic Counts of the First Rank Yi Deng Bo Yi Deng Bo Sao Kun Sao Kun Jin Yunpeng Jin Yunpeng Lu Jin Zhang Lu Jian Zhang Meng Enyuan Meng Enyuan Qi Yaolin Qi Yaolin Ku Yingguang Ku Yingguang Tian Wenli Tian Wenlai Yang Shand Yang Shan Dei Yang Zhengxin Yang Zhengxin Zhang Mingqi Zhang Mingqi Zhang Zailuan Zhang Shi Luan Zhu Jiabao Zhu Jiabao Topic Viscounts of the First Rank Yi Deng Zi Yi Deng Zi Li Ho Ji Li Hu Ji Lu Shanxi Lu Xianxi Zhang Guangjian Zhang Guangjian Zhu Qinglin Zhu Qinglan Topic Barons of the First Rank Yi Deng Nan Yi Deng Nan Kai Ru Kai Kai Ru Kai Chen Binken Shane Bing Kun Duan Shuyan Duan Xu Yun He Zonglian He Zonglian Jin Yang Jin Yang Long Jin Zhang Long Jian Zhang Long Jingguang Long Jin Guang Lu Yangshang Lu Yangshang Lu Daoyuan Lu Daoyuan Ma Anlang Ma Anliang Pan Juing Pan Juying Qi Yang Qi Yang Ren Kecheng Ren Ke Sheng Shen Jinjian Shane Jinjian Wang Yitang Wang Yitang Xu Shi Ying Xu Shi Ying Zhang Huizi Zhang Yiji Topic Baron of the Third Rank San Deng Nan San Deng Nan Feng Yushang 
Feng Yushang topic. See also Warlord era History of the Republic of China Self-proclaimed monarchy Military of the Republic of China Topic. References Topic. External links Media related to Empire of China at Wikimedia Commons